Today, I'm gonna show you how to root the mulberry cutting. So this variety is a Pakistan mulberry. So I need a cutting. So best is about 10 to 12 inch long. And I need a pot with soy in there. So there is different way of root the cuttings. For mulberry, it's easy to root. So you don't need a rooting hormone. But if you want to use the rooting hormone, it's okay as well. But I'm gonna show you to root it without the hormone. So when you receive the cuttings, you should put in the water for about 12 to 24 hours. It's okay to put it up to a week, you know, until when you have time to root it. You don't have to do it right away as long as you put in the cup with the water about one to two inch high. So I wet the soil in the pot, really, really wet. And I'm gonna make a little hole, about, I would say, the two inch down. And you put the cutting into it, and cover it. Pack it a little bit to make sure that it doesn't, you know, fall over, okay? I'm gonna put all three cutting into one pot, but you can use uh, one cutting for each pot. Pack it tight, all right? And you can wet a little bit with water again. And you want to use a bag. So this one's a bag I got from the supermarket, or you can use any bag you want. So this is a kosher bag that I use. I'm gonna cover the whole cutting with the pot. And then you can use anything to tie it down on the bottom of the pot. There we go. Create a little like a greenhouse. You leave the bag on for about, I would say that you should leave it on for two to three weeks. Depends on the weather of your area. Sometimes you might have to leave it on for the whole month. So the warmer it is, the better, but I don't want to leave it too hot because you're gonna cook it. So I leave it in, like I would say, 20% of sun and mostly shade. And you're gonna keep an eye on to make sure there's a new growth or the new leaves. So I'm gonna show you this one. is the one that I wrote about almost six weeks. As you can see, and there's a new growth coming out with the fruit. Right now is July 27. It's off season, but it's still giving a little fruit. It's so cute. I don't think that it's gonna make your fruit as a first fresh cutting. So this is a new growth and it shows that it's thriving. You don't need to pull it out to check the root. I don't recommend it. Just leave it at it and water it often when you remove the back. You will see a little drying right here on top. Don't worry about it because it will dry a little bit on top and it's not gonna affect the whole cutting. So that is a simple, easy way to root the cutting. Sometimes it takes a little longer. I will say give it a little time. The successful rate for rooting the mulberry cuttings is really high. But I have 80% of it. So good luck and have a nice day.